Hey guys, this is TNN and today we're going to have a look at the waterproof spray by Outdoor Life. Now this is the Never Wet alternative. Now I'm sure you must have heard Never Wet, but this is a much, much, much cheaper alternative to Never Wet. So here we've got the spray. Uh, we've got the Outdoor Life logo in on top of here. Waterproof spray. We've got high performance spray ideal for camping, hiking, fishing, cycling and all other outdoor activities. So it's mainly for sports and outdoor activities, so it's not really like never wet, but it is the cheapest and closest alternative. So for use of clothes, tents, traps, sleeping bags, packs, shoes and boots, ski, snowboards, power gloves and hats, maps, ropes, boat interior, canvas covers and etc. So how to do this? So area to be treated must be clean and dry first. Test for colourless in hidden area of the fabric that is to be sprayed. Spray fabric until wet, until wet. Wipe the wet area with an absorbent cloth. If any colour rubs off, do not use. Shake the can well before use and occasionally during spray. Hold upright 15 to 20 centimetres from the surface and spray with slow sweeping motion until, ev until evenly wet. Uh, overlap spray areas allow surface to dry up to at least 12 to 24 hours before using or until solvent smell is gone. A second application will further enhance the performance making sure to include all seams and leather soles. Test fabric for repellency with a few drops of water. If water soaks in, apply more protector. Reapply after extended use. Do not use this product on plastic, vinyl, fiberglass or suede. So fabric will dry within one to two hours. A second application will further enhance the performance. So we're going to go ahead and do this, we're going to try this out on my shoes over here. These are the only fabric shoes that I really had. So we're going to try it out on these. I'm going to do one shoe and then the other one I'm not going to do. And we're going to see how waterproof it is and let's see how long it lasts as well. And how long it can stay waterproof. Right, so it's actually raining quite a bit outside so I decided instead I'll just do it indoors and just lay a bunch of newspapers everywhere so it doesn't get ruined. So the left one we're going to spray with waterproof, the right one we're not going to use waterproof so let's move the right shoe away and we're just going to spray this one with the coating. So it says hold this up vertically and spray it 15 to 20 centimeters away from the shoe. Uh, I'm just, I'm just going to hope that the colour doesn't go. So shake it and spray it until the shoe gets wet. It actually smells quite bad. It smells like it does. It smells like paint, but like really strong paint with adhesive stuff to it. I'm also going to do the inside sole bit over here and the laces. All right, we're going to let that dry for about an hour or two, and. <coughs> really smelled bad. We're gonna let that dry for about an hour or two and then we'll do a second coat and let's see if it's waterproof after that. Okay so it's now dried and we're going to add a second coat so let's go ahead and let's do that. So again shake this can. You're gonna to want to wear a mask actually so let me actually put on my mask because you don't really want to breathe these fumes in they're really really bad for you. So I'm gonna go ahead and put on the mask. Right guys, we are back and it actually dried in about an hour. So to check if it's dried, you just smell it and if the smell is gone of the spray smell, then it's basically dried. So this is, remember if you remember the right one was the one we sprayed with the the solution and the, so the left one was the one we sprayed with the solution and the right shoe was the one we didn't spray. So let's go ahead and let's first wet the right shoe and it's, it's drenched, it's completely wet. You can see over here, it's patched up and it's wet. Now let's go ahead and wet this shoe over here. And the water literally completely repels off of it and it's completely dry, it is completely dry, it's not wet at all. If you try on the back over here, let me just try and show you guys. The water just completely repels off and it is dry. 
it's not wet at all so that's absolutely amazing so let me go ahead and clean this up anyway so we'll be right back so overall score I give this spray is definitely 10 out of 10 I mean it's so much better than never wet I mean you pay a few pounds for this and never wet costs about 25 to 30 pounds this is only about fiver so for what it can do it's actually a really really cool product so the link to buy this will be down below in the description I'm actually selling it in my own personal store on eBay so if you're ever interested in anything else I review do check out my eBay store because I will be selling stuff that I review on there as well but the link to buy this will be down below in the description and it's really really a cool product I'll definitely give it higher than 10 out of 10 but you know you can't really do higher than 10 out of 10 but it's such a cool product and for the price I think it's absolutely amazing and it's really useful as well so link to buy will be down in the description again it is in my own store if you're interested in purchasing anything else I review I do sell some of the things on my store so don't forget to comment like and subscribe and as always thanks for watching this video